Hello, and welcome to Drinkwater Headquarters. As a new employee, you may be wondering how we managed to achieve our evil errands, and that's the very point of this informational video. So strap yourself in, and keep one hand, both feet, possibly even an earlobe inside the video at all times. Unless of course you pause the video because that will release you from the spell. Being an employee. As an employee of Drink Water, we ask that you help support the team by contributing to the sinister, maniacal, and devious environment that we have around the workplace. Be sure to always perform your tasks with a menacing, crooked smile. All employees should treat other employees with rudeness, constantly insulting any pictures of their children they may boast about during lunch. Not that you're allotted any time for lunch, because a real evil person eats the blood of their enemies when necessary. <laughs> People in charge. Meet Dark Shadow, the caring, compassionate, sexual deviant in charge of drink water. If there's anyone who knows how to drink water, it's this guy. This is Karen, the main secretary here at Drink... What? Uh... Okay. That's happening. Uh, moving on. Safety in the workplace. Well, honestly, there isn't any job that can be performed safely at drink water. This is the room of death. Oddly enough, it only brings people back to life. Our electrician Joe put the batteries in backwards, and it's been that way ever since. Which is a lovely segue into our next topic. Accidents that will brutally kill your face around the workplace. In order to avoid accidents, Drinkwater provides you with several types of safety equipment, such as goggles, mittens, hair extensions, mechanical hot dogs, YouTube accounts, fiber optic toothbrushes, carbon fiber socks, and angry rubber duckies with mustaches that can be used to keep you safe. I'm an evil duck! Now, you're obviously interested in joining our evil organization because you're watching this video, and where there's evil, there's death. So we just want you to fully understand you have a 99.9, .9, repeating of course, chance of dying. Don't fret, but in the event that you do die, please complete the I am dead form, also known as the IDF, and tell your area supervisor as soon as you realize that you are dead. If upon working you stumble across a dead coworker, do the polite thing, and make sure they're dead by lopping off their head with one foul swoop. The Mess while glorious and heartwarming, will be taken care of by our janitor Pablo. This here's Francis. He lost his arm for drink water. Let's all give a round of applause for Francis. Come on Francis, join in! Oh, relationships in the workplace. This is not a dating site. No matter how much you possibly have an urge to use your Drygor longsword, to slay the blood velds within Karen's Slayer dungeon, or how much you crave for Dark Shadow to deposit his memories in your rift. It's not worth the XP rates. The last thing we need is for you people who are stupid enough to work for us to take the world with your spawn. <laughs>